Your body is an amazing thing. It can eat, sleep, run around, talk to other people, think, and even play. Your body also grows throughout your life, transforming you from a newborn baby into a fully grown adult. But when you start to become a teenager, your body will suddenly change in many ways. Uh, Not only will you become taller and stronger, but certain parts of your body will also start to feel a little different. While these changes will seem a little strange and even scary, everyone goes through them, so you have nothing to worry about. In this video, we will teach you about all the ways that your amazing body changes you into a big, strong adult. We will also teach you how your new grown-up body can help you make a baby. <laughs> now, of course, I'm a liver. And I'm a pancreas. Originally, two other organs were supposed to host this video, but one couldn't get himself up today, and the other one also came up dry, so <laughs> we'll be here instead. But don't you worry, kids, because we're just as important as those unreliable douchers, and we'll teach you just as much valuable information about your growing body. So, let's get started. What is puberty? The medical definition of puberty is the process of physical changes by which a child's body matures into an adult's body, capable of sexual reproduction to enable fertilization. <laughs> but we say otherwise. In actuality, puberty is the process of physical changes where certain body parts gain a sense of self-entitlement and begin to inflict selfish reprisal and torment on the rest of your body. Boys, is your voice starting to crack? That's not because you're becoming a man, that's because your penis hates you. That's right, hormones from your balls are telling your larynx to explode, ruining your speaking voice in an attempt to obliterate your reputation because your dick is an evil monster. You're also going to start growing hair on new parts of your body. But wait, forget about the fact that you actually now have the ability to grow a manly, heroic mustache because your nuts need to get in on this one as well, selfish fucks. Batter up, ladies, because you're about to be thrown a curveball that would strike out even Derek Jeter if he had a coup. Once a month, you're going to start bleeding out your hoo-ha non-stop for a whole goddamn week, and it's going to feel like you're being repeatedly shanked in the uterus. This is called a period, but it might as well be called gametic genocide because the vengeful wrath of your ovaries will make your lower torso feel like a theater of war. At this point, your body is developed, and you now have the ability to make a baby through the process of sex. <laughs> Prom night's just around the corner, Johnny, and you've got a hot date. You're gonna do the deed, right? Wrong, because of that fresh batch of acne spanning the top of your forehead down to the bottom of your cheeks. Sorry, Johnny, but you're not gonna get laid with all that follicular gland inflammation. All thanks to the wonderful sex hormones being secreted by your wiener. And what is sex anyway, you might ask? Sex is where a penis and a JJ come together to share in each other's self-importance and screw over the rest of your body in its process. Want to know what I did Friday night? While you went and knocked boots in a random bedroom at that post-prom party, Sarah? I filtered out all the shitty keystone from your blood so you wouldn't die while your irresponsible kooka contracted chlamydia. Meanwhile, I simply took on the dual role of an endocrine and an exocrine gland, producing the insulin, glucagon, and pancreatic polypeptide necessary to maintain healthy glucose levels in your blood. And who even cares that I secreted digestive enzymes into your small intestine, you know, disturbing the catabolism of important macromolecules, you know? <laughs> no, no, no big deal. Definitely not important enough to have a video made of that. <laughs> yeah, and who even gives a shit that we basically keep you alive as long as you're popping boners left and right, your penis will always get all the glory. Yeah, and as long as you've got a rack, no one will ever ogle at your huge gallbladder and nice supple lungs. Wait, 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 don't look over there! is over! Resistance is futile, you defenseless fools! It's time for the liver and pancreas to take the throne of dominant viscera around here! <laughs> yeah, I guess they're just jealous. Oh, 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 oh uh, jealous? Ha, jealous. Why would we be jealous of you guys? Because you're both virgins. Oh, oh no, you did not! Oh, no. oh, oh. Welcome to the castration stage! 